Hey, welcome back. You're watching VR Gamer Dude, and I'm Don. And well, today we are going to be doing something completely different for me on this channel. So, you guys know I love my Yaw VR. I mean, it is the only way that I can fly now. I, you know, if I'm going to play a driving game, I'm going to hook up the wheel and pedals. You bet your bottom dollar I'm going to do it in this because it feels amazing. But it's always been flight games and driving games, so I was blown away to find out that Marineverse has added native YAW VR support to the Quest 2 version of Marineverse Cup. So, another game that requires no PC, if you have the YAW, or the, if you're one of the lucky few few that are receiving the yaw 2 currently here it is guys if you have a quest 2 you're going to be able to play this game right from your quest 2 and i'm going to show you how so all right let's go oh cool i'm on the dock nice very cool. So got it. Got a got a vibe going already. We got, you can hear like the you know the, the the clinking of the boat back there and the water. And we got some seagulls flying over. And man, I'm digging the skybox. It's already looking beautiful here. So okay, what we can do in Marine Verse Cup here is we can learn how to sail, right? You know, for the purposes of this video, I'm not gonna go through all of that because I just want to see if it works with the Yaw VR because I have heard that it is supposed to and I am really excited to have another native Quest 2 game. Um, so that makes three now, I guess. So we've got Epic Roller Coasters, uh, we've got uh, Ultra Wings 2, which I discovered a few weeks ago, and uh, you've now got Marineverse, which apparently has the Yaw VR. Um, uh, support in it. So we're going to go ahead and skip the onboarding for now. We're going to go ahead and check out that support. So let's see. Here we go. We'll probably go into other. And there we go. Absolutely. And cool to see B haptic support as well. So damn, I should have pulled out my tax suit for this. So maybe that's another video. I don't know. If this works well enough, maybe I'll put them together. Oh, wow. Wouldn't that be cool? That'd be neat. All right, so um, let's see here, y'all VR, and there we go. It finds my simulator. Let me hacking my sim there, guys. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and here hit connect here, and we'll start the device. And I felt a nice little jolt there, so that does mean that I have connection to my y'all VR natively from the Quest absolutely no wires this is a dream come true now do i expect to get full motion out of the simulator for this nope sure don't uh, so i don't expect that the chair is going to spin at all um in fact I'm, you know i was kind of trying to think to myself what kind of motion am i going to get with a sailing game and you know, I guess maybe it's a little bomb of the water or, you know, but I mean, really to make it fully believable, you'd think you'd want that yaw turning. So hopefully there is turning. I don't know if there's going to be or not, but we're going to jump in and find out. So, all right, let's see here. We could do a tour of the boats. Uh, we could do a sailing lesson. Um, ooh, try a race or just relax. I think we should do that. Um, so, let's see, we can do the dinghy time trial or the yacht time trial. So I think we'll start with a dinghy and then maybe we'll jump over to a yacht and, uh, or we can just free sail the dinghy. Okay, let's just free sail. Okay, so we're just gonna free sail the dinghy um, and uh, see if it works in the yaw. So let's go. Oh, okay, whoa. Whoa, okay. <laughs> uh, the best ahoy. part of Marineverse Cup is racing. Uh, okay, well, you know, right Once now, you have tried the boat, um, I'm just, sailing in a race. just, just the wanting to, the uh, fun part of the game. To, to see if it works in my yaw, buddy. So, um, here we are. Um, wow. Okay, um, I'm definitely, okay, just sitting in the bowl, 
and sitting in this boat like this, it, it already makes it feel more believable uh, without even one single bit of motion. But as you see, it's like immediately it tilted with the boat here. So very cool. All right, I guess we need to go ahead and see if we can get going here. So let's go ahead and pull our sail. Try to get some. Trying to get some. Oh, there we go. Okay, so it looks like sticks are going to be our rudder here. Whoa, oh, wow, oh, okay. So definitely getting some like jerks to the left and the right here to go along with that sail. Oh, I'm filling up with water. Oh, I'm going to sink. I'm going to sink before I even start. Oh, uh, okay. Okay, so I am definitely feeling some movement from the yaw, but. I'm not gonna lie, it's not much. Just, just. Okay. Ah, don't hit the dock. Okay. So it does seem like really what I'm getting here in the simulator is a lot of the just side to side motion. Which I guess was really, like I said uh, just a minute ago, was, was really what I expected. But, oh man, if this could just rotate, even slightly, I mean, it, if you could just get the boat to rotate just ever so slightly, um, it would make this so much more believable. So, oh, we're in Sydney. Nice. But I will say, I mean, overall, very cool. I mean, you know, it definitely gives me that feeling that I'm like kind of on the water here um, and, and I am getting kind of just the slightest little movement here and there um, but I'm not gonna lie I was, was kind of wishing that it would be a, a little bit more <laughs> as, as I say that and like get flung to one side here but, you know, once again, as I've said in many, many, many videos, uh, you know, even the slightest little amount of, of, of presence enhancement that you can do in a game. So just this little tiny bit of rocking that I'm getting with the boat here. As you can see, it's like it's almost like rocking the boat with my yaw. So it's it's kind of cool. And normally the yaw it like really locks you hard. And this is like almost kind of giving me some play so that I can rock that boat. And you can see I'm I'm noticing that it kind of rocks with my yaw as and I'm manually making this happen uh, just by shifting my weight. But it does seem like it's shifting the weight of the boat as well. So once again causes that to be a lot more believable but once you know I, like i said i just i like to feel lots of motion so it's just i don't know maybe the yacht i don't know maybe when we sail the yacht still not going to get any um oh there we go okay so cool i don't have to sit there and hold that rope like this so you can just pull back on the stick very cool oh little fluffy clouds Little, 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 little fluffy clouds. And whoa, man. Like I said, even just that little tilt makes you kind of feel it a little bit. Ah, there we go. Oh, we're going to get some speed now. Let that sail out. So, you know, I guess, like, I guess I should comment a little bit on the game as well. Um, so graphically, you know, it looks really, really nice uh, for a Quest game, uh, for a Quest 2. I mean, not that, you know, games look bad on the Quest 2 in any way, shape, or form, but uh, got some billboarding with the clouds. I hate that. It's a symptom of old VR still haunting us. So, developer, if you can, solidify your cloud a little bit, because, I don't know, that's just a weird sensation. But, back to what I was saying, it, you know, I don't know, presence, enhancement, blah, 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 it's really cool, e even a little rocking is a little cool, so, very nice, and, and it looks great, and it plays great, so... I think I've seen what I need to see, guys, so um, I am going to go ahead and cap the video here, make this one a short one. Like I said, this was not a, a true full review of 
marine verse by any means. This was just me jumping in to test their y'all VR support. And I want to thank marine verse for putting y'all support in the game. Uh, I mean, that is huge to have another natively supported quest two title. And, and I, and I guys, I can't tell you how much that means to me and a lot of other people. So, you know, other developers, if you're watching this video, man, consider it, you know, if you've got a flight game, a driving game, or now I guess a sailing game, um, you know, we would love to see support in it. So if you have questions, I'm happy to answer them. I don't work for y'all, but, but man, I sure love my y'all. So um, anyway, for me, I think that is going to do it, guys. Like I said, thank you so much for watching to the end of the video if you made it this far. And uh, if this was your first time coming by, thank you so much. It, you know what to do. Everybody's always asking you. But, you know, I'm going to do the same thing because I really want to see 10,000 subscribers this year on my channel. So do me a solid. Hit that like. You know, go ahead and hit subscribe if, if you really liked it. And, and ring the bell so you get notified. And and if you've already done all that, guys, I love you. You know I do. Um, and uh, I, that, I don't need to say anymore. So I will see you in the next one. This is Don signing off. <laughs>